Hello. Hello, hello, Marlene. Hello, can you listen to me or not? You cannot listen to me? Hi. Let me see, Marlene, are you here? Let me see, I will type in the shot. Marlene, are you here? Hello. Can you listen to me, Marlene? Marlene Idania Escobar de Marroquín. Are you here or not? Not, right? You are not here probably. So that's the reason why you cannot listen to me. Uh-huh. Hello. Marlene, are you here? Hello, teacher. Sorry. <laughs> uh, okay. I was calling Marlene a lot of times, right? Yes, I um, I only that. Okay. How are you today, Marlene? Fine, teacher. And you? I I think I'm a little bit tired today. Yeah. Nah. I'm feeling tired. I First, have an event first. at the university next ah, week. Okay. So I am preparing the things for that, right? It's going to be a French event about the culture of French. Right? Really? Yes. You were speaking in, in, in French. French? Yes. <gasps> wow. Congratulations, teacher. Thank you. Thank you so much, Marlene. I appreciate it. So that's the reason why I am feeling tired, right? Yes, but thank you so much for being right here. We have another person right here, but she's connecting the audio, right? So right now she cannot listen to us. Mm -hmm. Ni lo demás. <laughs> yes. Imagine the rest of the people, right? Imagine we are only three right now and it, it is 802. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Hello, Sarai. Ah, no, Sarai told me that she is working, I remember. So she cannot answer. Good evening, teacher. <laughs> yes, Sarai? Hi, teacher. Hi, Sarai. How are you today? I'm fine. Fine, okay. Nice to have you here. Thanks for being right here. We are few people right today. I don't know why, but it doesn't matter. I think that we are ready to start with the class. Okay. I am waiting for Adri. Okay. Here we have Adri. Hello, Adri. How are you today? Hello. Hi, teacher. How are you today? Fine. Fine. Okay. Nice to have you right here. Thank you so much for being here. As I said, right? Uh, we are a few people, only three people. Kind of weird, right? But um, we are going to start with the class. You see, you are interested in learning English. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. So we are going to have a little activity, a little oral activity, because I want you to learn and, and I want you to practice English. So let's start. Let's start with the first person that entered to the meeting, right? Let me see. You're not going to connect that. Okay. Don't worry, Marlene, I understand it, okay? So, Marlene, let's start. Can you choose one box, please? Mm, nine. Nine. Number okay. nine. Okay, you are going to choose, it says between parentheses, if it is simple present or past. So look at it. You have time, so you have to be fast, fast, fast. I'm sorry. Is he... I know, no teacher, not the. <laughs> Go ahead. He went with his parents. Aha, uh -huh. excellent. You see, you were feeling pressure because of the time, right? <laughs> <laughs> Me asustó, teacher. Yeah, you see. <laughs> okay, thank you, Marlene. Then we have Sarai. Sarai, can you can you help us or not? No, right. Uh, because Sarai told me that she is working. 
That is why I'm asking. But no, okay. So, Andre, you go, please. Choose one box. Um, eight. Eight. Remember that you have time. It okay. says simple past. Um, she liked, liked it? Liked. Yeah, liked. Exactly. Yes. Okay. Before we continue, let, let me type in the chat, right? Because we are few people. So give me a second. I will I will type in the chat, right? So that people can join. Okay. I am typing in the chat. Give me a second. Okay. There you go. So let's continue. One more time with Marlene, right? Go ahead, please, Marlene. <clears throat> Number five. Number five. Let's see. Number five. Simple past. Uh huh. She visit. Visit. <laughs> Which one? D. D. Okay, let's see. She visited. Visit. It's going to be visited. 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 Exactly. That's she going to be. China, then G, and then Australia. Exactly. Excellent. Thank you so much. Now let's see another number. No, number, Adri. <laughs> number four. Number four. Ah, this is impressive, right? Bondi okay. Beach. Uh, Bondi Beach is in no. Sydney. Okay, exactly. In the present, right? Bondi is a name, is the name of the beach, right? Exactly. Thank you so much, Adri. Now, one more time, already. Number 10. <clears throat> Let's see. Simple pass. I I was camping with my friends. Exactly. Yes. Easy, right? Easy for you. Now let's see, Adri, one more time, please. Number two. Number two. Let's see. Simple pass. She uh, she uh, took dancing class. No. Uh -huh. She <laughs> took dancing classes. Exactly. <laughs> you were feeling the pressure, right? <laughs> Okay, thank you. One more time, Marlene, please. Number seven. Number seven, let's see. Simple pass. She, again, I oh, know this is another one. <laughs> she takes, no, 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 no. She took a picture of Cairo. Exactly. She took a picture of Cairo. Excellent. Let's see, Adri, one more time. Number six. Number six. This is going to be... Uh, the country of Egypt uh, was very... Polluted. Po po polluted. No. Polluted. Uh -huh. Aha. It says no, right? Aha. Uh -huh. It was. Exactly. Let's see later. Okay. Don't worry. Mm. Don't worry. Teacher le puso where? Ah, uh, really? <laughs> Okay. Oh my God. You see, Adri? So sorry for that. There's no problem. Let me see. Let's see that that finished. Okay. Okay. You start again. We, we were six, three, and one. Okay. The time is over. So that's the reason why. So in six, let me see one more time. Yes. You I choose guess. where. Imagine the teacher. Right? Yeah, Adri. Say, 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 said, said, was, was, <laughs> oh my God. And Adri was like that, right? Yes, so sorry. Okay, thank you, Marlene. So Marlene, we're missing only two more. One or three? You decide. Three. 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 Okay. Ah, no, this one, this one was already, I think. No. No? Three, three no. Okay, let's see. She took... Dancing class. class. Dancing class, okay. And the last one that we are going to have for Adri 
is this number one, one. Mm -hmm. number one oh my god Lovely look beach. at it this one is <laughs> it's, already right it's insane. <laughs> yes i don't know what's going on with this game. yes the order right ah here we have a new uh, one we, we were we were hanging hang, hanging hanging out what is that do hanging you know with some hanging. friends hanging out hanging out uh-huh yes hang out will be the verb hang out okay and we also have this word right i will type it in the chat and later i will give you the meaning okay, okay. later si, will... que significa eso perdón teacher i will give you the meaning later okay because i want to finish with the game give me a second because i want to see the other one that we were missing okay give me a second okay. We were missing one more, and I don't know which one. Ah, this one? No, right? She went. He sí, went. He went. went. Yes, he he went. went. Sí, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Ya la, la dijimos. Ay, oh my God. Let me see. Number seven. She, ah, you're ready. Right. She took. Them. Yeah, took. Okay. Mm -hmm. Only three more options, right? Ah, here we have it. Eating insects, <laughs> simple past, right? We have was and where. Mm -hmm. Was. Was? Okay, let's see. Exactly, eating insects. Because we can replace eating insects for the subject eat. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the reason why. Okay, so now uh, answering the question of Marlene, hang out. It means like go out and have fun. Okay. Go out and have fun. Okay. So I can say I will hang out with my friends. For example, right. It means that I am going out and also I am having fun with them. And the last okay, one. Teacher. You're Thank welcome. You. Okay. In number two, it is polluted. That is the pronunciation. Polluted. Okay, polluted means contaminado. Okay. Okay, mm -hmm. so there you go, polluted. That is the pronunciation. And pollution, oh, pollu contamination. it's going to be contamination, exactly. It's going to be contamination. Okay, excellent. Okay, so we have more people here, right? Welcome, Raquel. Raquel. Yeah, Carlita. Sorry, I said Raquel. Welcome. How are you today? Fine. Fine. Okay. Thank you for being here. Hello, Beto. How are you today? Hi. Hello, teacher. How are you today, Beto? Are you feeling good or not? Yes. A good teacher, yes. Okay, thank you for answering. Thank you so much for being right here. We're going to move on into this activity, right? Look at it. It says a good day and a bad day. So the question is this one for you. Let's start with Adri. Adri, for you, what can be a thing that make that makes your day a good day one thing that happened to you that can make your day good well when i can sleep okay uh, when i can eat okay yes sorry but comer tranquilamente calm right calm exactly okay Good, good question. Good question. Good answer. And what about a bad day, Adri? What makes your day bad? No sé cómo decirlo en inglés, pero tal vez cuando cuando hago toda la carrera no me gusta. Okay, doing it in a hurry, right? Okay, mm -hmm. we can say being in a hurry. Esto significa estar en la carrera, right? In English. Mm -hmm. We say it in that way, estar a la carrera, being in a hurry. Okay. 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 Thank you so much, Adri. 
What about you, Marlene? What make, what are the things that make your day a good day? <coughs> Cuando descanso, teacher. Ah, do you know how we can say that in, Sp in Spanish? In English? In English? No, I don't know. You don't know? Okay, we can say when I rest, right? Rest. rest. Exactly. Uh -huh. Aha. Mm -hmm. And what about a bad day? Bad day. Aha. Uh -huh. <sighs> mm. uh, hard. El trabajo pesado. Hard. Work. Hard work, right? Eso. Uh -huh. Hard uh, work. Me duele la cabeza. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yes, I think it's normal. Okay, thank you so much. What about you, Carlita? What are the things that make your day a good day? Your microphone. Um, Quérame, teacher, lo voy a pensar. Okay, <laughs> think about it. <laughs> Think about it. Um, um, quizás cuando, bueno, en la, ma en la mañana, cuando, cuando tengo tiempo de arreglarme el, el cabello. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, we can say that. Um, uh, have time to comb the hair, for example, right? Mm -hmm. To comb the hair. Okay, when yes. you comb your hair. Mm -hmm. Well, it will be half time, right? To comb the hair. To comb the hair. Okay. Nice. Mm. And what about a bad day? Mm. Uh -huh. um, quiero. Um, cuando me despierto tarde, teacher. Que me sonó la alarma y yo la, no me volví a dormir y... Okay. Me okay, I get it. Wake up late, right? Uh -huh. Yes, that make your day a bad day. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Now let's see, Beto, for you, what are the things that make your day a good day? Mm -hmm. um, um, vacation. Aha, uh -huh. one, one more time. What was the, the, the verb? Vacation, what? Sí, vacation, cuando ya este, están las vacaciones. Ok, when it is vacation. Ok, excellent, a good day. Ok, I like it. And what about a bad day, Vero? Um, um, being sick. Ah, yes. And the term. <laughs> exactly, being sick. Oh, yeah, terrible day, right? Excellent. Ok, for me, a good day is when I can clean the house with my music. Ah, perfect, right? Like a perfect combination, right? You have your music and then you start being cenicienta, right? Ah, I like it a lot. So I will have music. Oops, it will be, yes, music and being alone, right? And being alone cleaning. Okay, and a bad day for me, a bad day will be when I don't have money, right? Not having money, right? That is a bad day. Exactly, because like life knows when you don't have money, right? Because that day you have to pay this, you have to pay that, and then it comes someone, right, and give me money for that. But you don't have money, right? Imagine, oh my God, that is a bad day for me. Okay, excellent. Now let's let's continue. Here we have who else is here? Oh my God, we are, it appeared Lisandro, right? The famous Lisandro. Hello and welcome back. Hi, teacher. Hi. How are you today? Hi. Hi. Fine. Okay, Lisandro, can you tell me what makes your day a good day? Uh, a good a good day for me mm -hmm. is go running. Okay. Go running. 
Okay, excellent. And what made, what are the things or the thing that make your day a bad day? A bad day for mm -hmm. me. Mm. Ah. Eh. Es que era? Dolor de cabeza, teacher. Headache. Eh. Headache. Okay. Yes. Okay, let me see. For me. Having headache, right? Correcto. Exactly. Okay, thank you so much, Lisandro. Now let's see. The last person that I have right here is Rosa Elba. Okay, Rosalba, can you tell me the thing that makes your day a good day? Mm, my puppy. Oh, yes. <laughs> exactly. Good. Your puppy, right? Okay, oh. so sweet. Excellent. And what about a bad day? Mm, the traffic. Exactly. Yes, I forgot that part, right? The traffic, we can say this in, in English, the traffic jam. It's when there is but a lot, a lot of traffic, right? Okay, thank you so much, Rosalba. So I will start asking, right? Asking this, but in the past, okay? So I can say, for example, um, let me see, Marlene. Marlene. Yes? Did you have time yesterday to comb your hair? Repeat. Okay. Did you have time yesterday to comb your hair? Yes, I was. No, yes. I. Uh -huh. I did. I... I did. Yes, I did. Exactly. Yes, I did. Excellent. Okay. Another question for you, Marlene. Did you wake up late yesterday? No, teacher, I didn't. Excellent. Good answer. Now, let's see. Vero. Vero, did you go running yesterday? Me puede volver a repetir la pregunta, teacher. For sure. Did you go running yesterday? Uh -huh. Did you go running yesterday? Uh -huh. Yes, teacher. Yes, I. Yes, I did. Yes, uh, I did. Uh, yes, I did. Excellent. Yes, I did. Okay, another one. Did you, let me see, did you have money yesterday? Vero, did you have money yesterday? Vero, are you here? Yes, um... Uh huh. Did you have money yesterday? Como, como este respondería la pregunta solo porque me está preguntando si si voy todo el día, vea. No, I am asking you this one. Look at it. Have money, tener dinero. Did you have money yesterday? Tenía dinero ayer? Or not? Uh -huh. No, I, I don't. In the past, it will be? No, I didn't. Uh, no, I didn't. Excellent. Thank you so much, Vero. Now let's see with Adri. Adri, did you have the time to play music? Being alone and clean the house yesterday? 
No, I didn't. <laughs> I can see it in your face, right? Since I started, did you have time? Absolutely no, right? I don't have. I don't, okay. I don't have time. <laughs> okay, I get it. Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Let's see another question for you. Mm -hmm. okay. Did you have headache yesterday? Mm. No, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. Let's see another person. Let's let's ask Carlita, right? Carlita, did you sleep and eat good and calm yesterday? Yes, I did. Excellent. Aha, uh -huh. let's see about they. Did you mm, did you work hard yesterday? No, I didn't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Honesty, right? Honest. And you are honest. Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Let's see, Lisandro. Lisandro, did you rest yesterday? Did you rest? Did... Rest. This one. Yes. Rest. Yes. Rest. That is descansar. Okay. Oh. Mm, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, excellent. Now, let's see. Well, it is not excellent, right? So sorry for you. But let's see another one. Um, Did you wear in a hurry yesterday? Mm. This one. Did you wear in a hurry yesterday? Maybe. ¿Qué es eso, teacher? Ahí sí no le... En apuros, a la carrera, right? Oh. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, thank you so much, Lisandro. Okay, give me a second. And, and I will I will put, plug in my charger of the computer. Okay, because I don't have battery right now. Okay, the teacher is back. Thank you so much. Okay, let's continue with another person. We have Rosa Elba right here. Okay, Rosa Elba, did you have vacations yesterday? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, let's see. Uh, were you in a traffic jam yesterday? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay, thank you so much. Then we have Marta, right? Hello, Marta. Welcome. Good morning. Good evening. Okay. Good evening. I will ask you one question. Okay. Let me see. Ah, do you have a puppy, Marta? Um, no sé qué. Puppy. Puppy is um the same as dog. Okay. Un perrito. Do you have a puppy or not? Yes, I did. Okay, so did you play with your puppy yesterday? Me está preguntando si el perrito. Okay, I will repeat the question. Did you play with your puppy yesterday? No. No? I did. I didn't exactly. Let's see another one. Did you wake up late yesterday? Yes, for sure. Did you wake up late yesterday? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, thank you so much. That was a good. Thank you all. Okay, now let, let's move on into the next activity. I don't know if you are able to see it. I will do it bigger. Okay, there you go with this. I think that you are able to see it. So what you have to do is basically choose the verb of this one so you could see. Oh, oh my God. Give me a second. Uh, we were in this one. Okay, basically you have to choose 
One of these verbs, according to the sentence, right? According to the sentence. So for that, and for sure that you are going to choose the correct verb and you are going to put it in the simple past tense, okay? So for that, you will have for sure minute, minute and time to do so. So for that, I will going to give you um, probably eight minutes, one minute per sentence because you have to choose the verb, okay? So did you get it? What we are going to do or not? Yes. Yes. Okay. So let's start. You will have eight minutes to do so. In case you have questions or doubts, let me know and I'm going to be right here. No se debe repetir el verbo, teacher. No, we have only one verb per sentence, okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. ¿Cuánto tiempo era, teacher? Perdón. Only eight minutes. Did you finish, Lisandro? Mm, yo creo que sí. Uh, okay. Okay. We are going to wait just a little bit. Okay. Let me see the time. Okay. Um, we are in minute number four. Let's give one more minute. Okay for everybody to finish. Okay. And then we move on into the next activity that I have right here for you.
Okay, let's see. Everybody finished or not? Who is missing? Yes. Yes? Okay, Rosa Elba, did you finish? Not teacher. No. Okay, Beryl, did you finish? <laughs> no. No. Marta, what about you? No. No. Okay. So um, I'm going to start with the rest, okay? So, for example, okay. let's start with Marlene. Marlene, what is the first one? Can you the tell first. me? Uh -huh. <clears throat> I think teacher Lucy enjoyed her birthday presents. Enjoyed, okay. Enjoyed. We are going to check that, okay? Later, don't worry. Now, okay. Audrey, the second one. Last week, last week I Last weekend I walked in the mountain for two hours. Excellent. Okay. Let's see Lisandro, number three. Perdón. We like the party very much. Okay, we liked the party very much. Okay, thank you so much. Carlita, your turn with number four. Can listen, 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 listen uh, to this favorite city yesterday. Exactly. Okay, let's see. Then we have. Rosa Elba, can you help me with number five, please? My sister studied much for, for an exam. Okay, my sister, what was the verb, sorry? Studied. Studied, exactly. Studied. Studied much for an exam. Okay, what about you, Martita? Can you help me with number six, please? Mm, they were trying to drop. No, they are something like this. Uh huh. Mm. Tra, tra, tra. ¿Cómo se dice tra? No. Yes, it will be traveled in the past. Travel. Travel. Traveled. See. Okay. Did they traveled? Let's repeat, Tra please. Travel. Traveled. Exactly. Travel. Traveled. Excellent. Travel. To the USA. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you so much, Marta. Let's see. Beto, can you help mm -hmm. me with number seven, please? Mm -hmm. Dad, uh, Walker is car last weekend. Okay, Dad? Dad, Walker. Aha, uh -huh. what? Is a uh, car last weekend. Okay, are you sure? Because we already have that adjective, yet, <laughs> that verb. Ya tenemos ese verbo, entonces no lo podemos ocupar. Es cierto, no me había mm. recatado. Sería wash. Ah, wash uh, exactly. It will be washed. Yeah, wash o o se, también ponerle adjetivo y de wash. No. It will be that washed. Okay, washed. Agregamos ese sonido de te al final porque es el verbo wash termina con voiceless sound. ¿Se recuerdan cuando poníamos los dedos aquí? Y no vibraba, sí. entonces es voiceless. Wash. Ok. Thank you so much. Vero. Then let's see another person who can help me. I am missing who? Saraino, because she's working. So it's going to be Marlene, one more time, please. Ok. The last one. 
Okay, the film finish. Finish like this? At 11.30. Okay, the verb is like this or not? Finish. <laughs> finish, exactly in that way. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much for your participation, guys. In this case, we are going to correct only one thing. Only one little detail because it's going to be upside down. Okay? We're going to have listen, listen, <laughs> light in the first light. one. Lucy, light, her birthday presents. And right here, we are going to have enjoyed. We enjoyed the party very much. Tienen los dos sentidos, o sea, podemos tenerlo en esa manera, pero tiene más sentido si lo tenemos como les digo. Porque aquí estamos diciendo, Lucy disfrutó sus regalos de cumpleaños. Y aquí... A nosotros nos gustó mucho la fiesta. Pero sonaría mm -hmm. mejor si decimos que a Lucy le gustaron sus regalos de cumpleaños y que nosotros disfrutamos mucho la fiesta. ¿Ok? So, it will be upside down. Upside down significa al revés. ¿Ok? It will be upside down. Upside down. Mm -hmm. Al revés. There you go with a new word. Okay. Thank you so much for your participation. That was so good. So now let's move on into this little part. And I think that's going to be the last one for today. So as you could see, you are going to write. But in this case, you are going to write and take pictures of your work. Okay. And you are going to send them to me. Because I want you to see the way you write the verbs. Okay. So there you go. What you are going to create is the same sentence in the past in positive, negative, and interrogative. Okay, the three ways because I want you to practice. Yes, Lisandro. En español. Okay, en español sería esta oración que ven aquí está en presente simple. La van a pasar a positiva. En pasado simple, en negativa, en pasado simple, e interrogativa. Mm. Ok, did you get it, Lisandro? Bien difícil. Bien difícil. <risa> no, hombre, si esto está fácil. Si ustedes en dos minutos lo terminan. Dos minutos les voy a dar para hacer las ocho. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, okay? I'm just kidding. No me maten. Okay, I will give you more time. Okay, I will give you more time. Don't worry, don't worry. I will give you, I think that 10 minutes. 10 minutes. I will give you 10 right now, and I will ask you if you finish. Okay? Okay. Okay, only 10 right now. Remember that you have to write them because you are going to send me a picture, okay? Me van a mandar foto, entonces quiero que lo escriban. Link. Teacher, significa yes. tidy. 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 Tidy significa ordenar. Mm -hmm. Ordenar un cuarto, por ejemplo, mm -hmm. pero no ocupamos tidy para ordenar comida. Mm -hmm. Ok, para ordenar comida si ocupamos el order. verbo order. Exactly. Exactly. Good question, Ari. Excellent. Okay, quiero ver your beautiful letter, right? In my cell phone. So that is why I'm asking for a photo.
Y esta tarea es para hasta para mañana, teacher. No, hombre, Lisandro, si usted lo anterior lo terminó en dos minutos. No, pero... Rapidito lo hizo. Ya me hizo cambiarme de... <risa> <risa> oh, my God, Lisandro. Si esto está fácil. Ay. Una copia de la primera, va. Y hacemos las otras. Va. Va, no se la voy a dar. Primera. La primera, solo para que tomen el ejemplo. Es que ustedes, de verdad. Ok, it will be. En positivo. Ok. Esta sería la primera positiva. Se la voy a mandar en el chat para que la tengan. La otra negativa. Si está fácil, ¿ve? Solo le agregan el didn't. ¿Eh? Ahí está, ¿ve? Ahora vamos con la siguiente interrogativa. Vaya, se vieron. Si sí, está en dos minutos, o sea, sí. Ok, there you go. Ahí tienen el ejemplo. There you go. My sister tidied her room yesterday morning. My sister didn't tidy her room yesterday morning. And Did my sister tidy her room yesterday morning? Ya ven, si no le pido al eh, copia a la teacher. Uh -huh. <ríe> Ay, Lisandro. Uh -huh. sí. ¿En cuál van? Let's see, Adri. 
In which one are you? In the three, okay. In the three. Okay, what about you, Carlita? La Adrianita ya está terminando. Three. And you, Lisandro? Mm -hmm. Copiando la que usted hizo. Ay, Dios, <laughs> Lisandro, no, hombre. <laughs> Okay, Rosa Elba, what about you? D. G. D, la D. Ah, D. Okay, good. Let's see, Marlene, what about you? In C. C, okay. Martita? C. Okay, your microphone is off. Okay, but I think that you are in C, number three. Yes, no. Okay, Beto, what about you? And D. And D, okay, excellent. You are going to, you are going to, only Lisandra, right? Copying of the teacher. Hmm. Okay, um, let me see. We're going to finish only in E. Esta va a ser la última. Okay? E va a ser la última. You see only one, two, three, four, five sentences, right? Only five. Okay, you tell me when you go in letter E, okay? In letter E, so that we can start.
Finish, teacher. Finish. I just, you are like, oh my God. Like you were running a marathon, right? <laughs> okay, you can send me the picture, please. Okay, so that I can check them. Okay, I got it. Let me check them, Audrey. Okay. Okay, excellent, Audrey. No mistakes. No mistakes. Congratulations. <laughs> you see, you were like, ah, I finished. But you see, you got it. Excellent. Excellent. Perfect. Let's see the other person. The other person is Marlene. Let's see Marlene. Don't worry, Marlene. Okay, let's see. Let me see. Yo creo que me equivoqué todo, Ticha. Pero ahí le mando. Mm. Ni porque tenía el ejemplo, Valisandro. Sí. No sé. Good job, Marlene. Let's see, Lisandro. Let's see, Lisandro. Okay. Tidy up, even tidy. In trouble. I didn't clean. Okay, so good, Lisandro. So good. We only have one little thing, okay? In English, we we don't need the open question. I mean, this this symbol, okay? In English, we don't use it. In Spanish, we tend to use it, right? Because we say, "Cuál es tu nombre?" For example, right? But in English, we are going to say, what is your name? In that way. Look at it. Only in that way. Okay. Only closing that. Excellent. Okay. Please, if you finish, send me the picture through WhatsApp. You can go out, Audrey, if you want. Lisandro, you can go out. Marlene, you can go out. Please, because you already finished. Okay. So that will be all for today. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank, you, Thank right you, here. you, teacher. Bye. 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 Ya casi termino, teacher. Voy en la última. Yes, don't worry. Don't worry, okay? No problem. No problem. I'm going to be right here. There's no problem. Sería hasta la H, ¿verdad, teacher? No, no, no. Hasta la E. Hasta esta. Ah, okay.
Ah, ok, ok. Ah, pues ya casi lo mando. Ok, no Yo voy. ya terminé, Ticho. Yo ya voy hasta la, hasta la última. Hasta la Ay, última. Dios, Carlita. Y yo les dije, hasta les marqué la E y les dije hasta esta. Bueno, ahorita le mando la foto. <ríe> ok, Carlita. <ríe> Okay, thank you so much, Carlita. Oh my God, beautiful letter. I like it. Didn't leave it. Okay. okay, thank you so much, Adri. You can go out, okay? Thank you, thank you. Bye-bye, have a good night. Bye. Bye. Okay, Marta, if you want, you can send me the ones that you have, okay? Okay. Okay, so there's no problem. Send me the ones that you have and that will be it, okay? 